Oh my god, Credit Suisse Bank just got bought out by UBS and for only 3.2 billion? What the heck happened? Yeah, you're just saying this? This happened last Sunday. Well, catch me up then. I thought Swiss banks had a reputation for being stable and conservative. Tell me, how does a bank founded 167 years ago with total assets more than 500 billion end up to a point where they got bought out for pennies? Well, Credit Suisse was already not doing too hot for their investors. Plus they had quite a few scandals in the past few years as well. I do remember reading about a Bulgarian drug trafficking scandal in 2020. And then on top of that, you know how Silicon Valley Bank collapsed and then Signature Bank got shut down? Yeah, that happened like just last week, right? Right, so that spooked investors more and everyone started withdrawing money. Like we're talking 10 billions worth at a time. That's a bank run, right? Yeah, so I already made a video on this earlier, but it's kind of a self-fulfilling prophecy. I mean, if everyone becomes fearful and withdraws their money all at once, the bank will fail. Yeah, that's too bad. So then what? The Swiss authorities just decided to step in and take charge? Mm-hmm. In order to prevent further meltdown, the Swiss authorities stepped in and announced the merge. Some are even calling it a shotgun wedding and arranged marriage. Wow, we are living through history. I know, right? This is probably the biggest mega bank merge since 2008 financial crisis. And some follow-up points to note, in order to boost liquidity, the Swiss National Bank said it would provide a $100 billion loan to UBS and Credit Suisse. Additionally, as part of the deal, Swiss regulator FINMA announced that Credit Suisse's AT1 bond Bonds, the riskier bonds worth 17 billion dollars will be wiped out some investors fear that this will trigger further spillover risk for global credit all right this is jankster over and out